okay this is how you set up a user for recording now a normal user you all you would have to do is actually go to the phone and then go to their extension uh, for example to set up a phone for recording you would just go here to the extension but I'm actually finna do one for Tyler since he wants his call recorded but this is what you do for your typical user just go directly to the extension click on it scroll all the way to the bottom and and here's the recording profile options here but I'm actually gonna do one for Tyler's help desk help desk extension so I'm gonna go to device device settings device profile it's all the same once you get in there but like I said the profile the extension mobility profile extension needs to be recorded now his actual phones extension if that makes sense so you go to the device profile and <laughs> click on his extension and just like I said before same same setup just a different location here and we want to do automatic call recording choose the zoom call rec and you can just type in Z here and it'll automatically jump down to the zoom call recording server calling search space alright and that's what you have to do from the extension standpoint so the next is is just the same as you would any other user you need to actually find the phone that he will be using for um, recording calls and that happens to be we're gonna find it by going to 5698 and it's gonna be his desk phone so we're gonna click on his 7942 and built-in barge has to be on and privacy has to be turned off hit save next we need to go to user management application user hit find scroll down to the bottom where you see the zoom one and you're actually going to add his phone to the list of phones being recorded so it was his 7942 you just check the box hit add selected and hit save okay <clears throat> excuse me now the next thing we do is we need to go over to the zoom call recording server and add that extension so that he will be able to search it uh, I can't remember what it was so I need to actually go back and look at the extension he's using so Tyler has 2652 so the final thing we need to do is just log in here it's admin and the password is the same as the voicemail password and then you will go over to user and click on the group that you want to modify and come up here and hit edit group and add that extension forgot it again 2652 alright so we come over here and just come up here anywhere and type in the number that you want to add 2652 and separate it with a comma and then hit save and we're done